Hey guys, it's Marseille Martin and today I'm going to be walking you guys through my everyday skincare routine and also probably adding in a little boldish look. First step, number one. Okay. I go in with my Noxzema Classic Cream. My mom used this, my mom's mom used this. A little goes a long way. My skin can be very sensitive sometimes and that's why I try to use as many like natural things for my skin as possible. I never rub the towel on my face. I usually dab it like this. We're gonna go in with our Tatcha Rice Polish Foliator. Use that much. We could, you could we can use a little more today. That's fine. Wet it a little bit and bam, look. I'm gonna go in with a mask that is the red algae mask. Rub it on my hands a little bit. I kind of put it where I break out the most because I'll wake up and just have weird breakouts. I'm like, okay, it's all right. Because this mask pulls it together well. Blackish was my very first TV show and I am so grateful that my first TV show was a crew that really loved me like a family would. They would take care of my skin and make sure there was no makeup at all, like when I was like nine. And I used to be so mad <laughs> because like my siblings and them out and my TV mom, they would be getting makeup and stuff, looking all good at seven o'clock in the morning. And I'd be like, dang, all I get is some chapstick. And then the more I grew up, we upgraded to mascara and I was, <laughs> I was so hyped. <laughs> I was so, so excited. Even though I didn't have a lot of makeup on set, I always had hair looks. So there was like my natural curls. I learned very young to be confident in my hair and in myself. So even if I had a bare face, I knew my hair was popping. All right, bam. We got a fresh face. I'm gonna go in with my three notes of facial toner. And then I use my other one. I just go like this. A rescue oil, because now we are in the moisturizing phase. I put a few drops of this. Look at my face. I love this stuff. I love it. Next, I'm going to be putting in my eye cream. My girl, Lloyd Harvey. She knew what she was doing when she made this, all right? Being a black girl, I always wanna make sure that the young girls that are coming behind me or people that just aspire to do probably the same things that I'm doing, just make sure they have somebody to look up to. You know what I mean? You have cortisone, which is what I use for different blemishes or breakouts or things that may have a little itchy feeling to it. We're just gonna put it in the places that I usually get um, breakouts in. Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream, which is a little goes a long way. Black Girl Sunscreen. And Black Girl Sunscreen is literally for us by us type thing. I'm gonna show y'all my makeup. First, I go in with the Makeup Forever eyebrow pencil. I just like to fill them in like just the slightest bit. I stopped waxing my brows a long time ago <laughs> cause one lady messed them up and I was low key traumatized. I was like, oh heck no. No one's touching my brows. I'll leave this part alone. I'm gonna go in with my Anastasia Brow Wax. I just grab it a little bit like that. Just like I do with mascara, I like just easily coat it. Our Fenty Beauty Sunstalker Palette. We love you, Rihanna. I usually like to use, it, it's kind of between these two. Hold on, these two. Some of the beauty icons that I look up to, definitely Lady Gaga and Rihanna for sure. This is the Tarte Eyeliner. And then we have our Urban Decay, which is a, a super dope neon electric eyeshadow stick. 
And yeah, we're going to just kind of go back and forth between these two. Now that we have this one, we're going to try to do that one. Okay. And I think that's the hardest part because whether it's brows, eyeshadow, anything, it, it's never going to be twins. It's going to be sisters. With me, it's probably going to be cousins. This is the reason why I do my base last because I want to make sure that I look is exactly how I want it. So I don't mess anything else up. I'm going to go back and forth from using this and then also using a teeny tiny brush to make sure it is uh, very put together. I'm going to be going in with my Fenty Beauty Matchsticks and these two are Truffle and Espresso and I'm going to go in with the Truffle one. And I'm gonna add a little bit of espresso as well. Follow the line of how my nose bridge is. These are two concealers. With my mom, she told me what's for you is what's for you and what's for you won't miss you. So back when I was doing a whole bunch of auditions, seeing if I would get the part or not. He always reminds me that everything has perfect timing. I'm gonna go in with a little foundation and sometimes I add some moisturizer into it. So I'm gonna put my Tatcha Dewy, Dewy moisturizer back into the mix. I've always liked a good dewy look. So I just added, boop. I'm gonna add a little bit of setting powder to go into these little corners right here. My Trio Lash is by Kits, a lash adhesive. And it's black, which I feel like everyone should do. If, if your lashes are black, use black glue. Right here, the best mascara. I recently finished a movie called Fantasy Football. That was lots of fun to film. That would have that would have been my second time filming in Atlanta because I also filmed Little there. We have my dad and on the in the movie, um, Amari Hardwick and the amazing Kelly Rowland playing my mom. My production company is. Only three years old. We have a lot of projects between TV and film. Some that I am in, some that I'm not in. That's mainly the goal is for genius to run itself. And eventually when I'm 30 something and on a boat somewhere, I can be like, hey. That is something that I am very, very grateful for. Next, we have Rare Beauty. Selena Gomez is so amazing. And she's also from Texas, D-Town baby. I'm not scared of it, honey. I'll add a lot. The Stila highlighter, and it is bronze. I usually like to use it with my finger. If I had to choose one thing, I think it would have to be liner. I have this amazing duo. The two best MAC liners I've ever seen is Chestnut and Cork. First, I go in with Cork. Now I go in with chestnut and I do the most thinnest line on top of the cork that I did. <laughs> you see it. Alrighty guys, this is the final look. This is my boldish eye look, getting ready to go to Target and take over the world. I will see you guys later. Bye.